We are Nux420 International 365. Welcome to our first video. This is our uh, selfie stick unbo uh, unboxing. Yeah, yeah, unboxing and review. Review. Uh, we have two selfie sticks in here. And uh, yeah, two days shipped on Amazon. Though this has been in a box for like a few days. So. Well, We're a little behind schedule. So we got this nice uh, bubble wrap. It's a uh, Air Plus brand by Storopack. Um, let's check the pop on these. Yeah, I mean, I've never loved the big um, bubble wrap. Like, it's just disappointing. Yeah, regular it is, it is wrap, worse than We can check it out. Wrap. Should we, should we test the pop? Yeah, you wanna go? Yeah, yeah sure. Right. Go I'm more it. of a non-popper, but okay. we can go for it. That's a solid uh, This is actually better than normal for this stuff. Yeah, this, this, it has nice squeeze, you guys. Okay. So, solid. Uh, two selfie sticks. We chose two different brands. Um, we got one with a tripod, a uh, tripod yeah. from MPow. Um, they maybe make other electronics. I'm not really sure. And then we got Fujitech, not to be confused with Fujifilm, the uh, photography company. Yeah. Um, which is self-described as the only selfie stick you need and a professional Bluetooth selfie stick. So we'll have to test how professional this selfie stick is. Yeah. And if it's the only one we need, thumb. Okay, opening up, going yeah, in. Yeah, we're doing it. Thing before we actually get to the selfie stick itself, is that the bag is a um, class seven uh, recyclable, which is the worst class as other, uh, which means that recycling plants are gonna have to have a harder time dealing with this. It's a chlorinated polyethylene, uh, so. That's pretty it's, disappointing. It's, that. it's a little disappointing. I would have liked to see, you know, in a O2 or an O3, uh, something that every recycling plant could handle. Yeah. Uh, but the bag does have a like a nicer, you know, feel. To oh, it. this it, has it, a. It great... is a quality feeling bag. Yeah. Um, like. It's just a shame at least there is a justification yeah. to how toxic this is, but it is a little disappointing to see so much plastic being used in modern packaging. Yeah. Like, I guess let's get into testing. Is it friendly? Oh. All right, so we are now using the selfie stick to record. It turns out my brother transferred high schools, but nobody told me. But yeah, I mean, go Dolphins, go love the lids. Now we're going to be unboxing uh, the Fugue Tech FT568 professional Bluetooth selfie stick for use indoors and outdoors. Uh, they list Camping, hiking, biking, uh, if you want to bike with your selfie stick, uh, mm -hmm. weddings, parties, concerts, or anywhere. So in addition to all of those six places, you could also use this anywhere. Uh, so we're opening the, opening the box. Uh, another disappointment. They give us this nice robot back, but within it, yeah. we got plastic. And it's, it's just Unnecessary. a shame. Like we're gonna have to recycle this or throw it out and throw um, another turtle. It is worth noting that this plastic is recyclable this time, type 4, uh, so it should yeah. be easier to recycle. Um, which is good to know, like, at least they, while they, it is a little disheartening that they included two bags, like, at least they, the plastic is recyclable. Yeah, and, uh, I mean, that's not to say that the other plastic wasn't recyclable, it's just uh, some plastic recycling plants have an easier time with yeah. the easier time. Max. Can you compare lengths a little bit? Yeah, let's compare the two. So for the Fugitech, it's oh, got... Yeah, we can also compare those lengths. So um, it seems like uh, it's about an inch shorter than uh, the um, MPAL, despite the selfie stick being longer. Hmm. Um, but it, it is, just, an inch is a world of difference. Yeah, I mean... Would work. Overall, yeah. Uh, what did I say? For 43. 43, yeah. yeah. Different scale though, so this one's actually lower than than. This okay, one. but 284. Uh, yeah, but it gets a 284. Uh, yeah. Until next time, Nux. Oh yeah.